This portion of today's video is sponsored by Caraway. I am so excited and thrilled to have the opportunity to work with them. I have had my eyes on this pot and pan set for a very long time, you guys. It is absolutely gorgeous. In person, it's even better. I decided to go with the beautiful gray color. I feel like it matched my kitchen perfectly. I am gonna do a little unboxing here and show you everything that comes in the set. You do get three lids and all of these lids will fit all four of the pots that you do receive. And it also comes with this lid organizer, which I think is amazing. You will just hang this on your cabinet door and it keeps everything nice and organized. What I really loved about this set is that it is non-toxic, non-stick, and it does have a ceramic coating. I will show you guys later in the video where I actually test it out. I've had this pot and pan set for quite a few weeks now, and I've cooked in it several different times, and I will say, out of all the pots and pans I've ever owned, I feel like this is the best and the most true to non-stick. It's absolutely gorgeous. This color is just beautiful. I know some of the reviews when I was kind of researching into Caraway where they felt like some of the coating kind of chips away or it stains. So far I have not experienced that. They still look beautiful and new. I feel like proper care is the most important part. These pots and pans do come with care instructions so there's a little booklet that will show you exactly how to properly care for your set and sustain the longevity of it the way you feel when i hold you i think i said enough you said you love for me something brand new you said this is something you would never do here we are in a car let me see who you are What was also nice is that it does come with, I think these are called like pot holders. You're gonna just place these on your counters. So if you have hot pans, you can set it directly on your counters and it's not going to ruin your countertops. This is a little booklet that gives you all of the instructions that you need to take care of your pots and pans. I really love that it comes with these organizer slots. So these are magnetic, as you can see here. If it is the wrong way, it's gonna pop off, but they all stick together. So it's going to keep your pots and pans in a nice neat order, and they are based on the size of the pots and pans. So you can move these around, organize and set it up the way that you want. I decided to display it on my countertops. It is beautiful, you see it matches my backsplash like perfectly. And if I want to, I can move it and store it underneath my cabinets. But I feel like on top of my counters, it just gives my kitchen a nice statement piece. It's beautiful and it's all nice and organized. You know we love organization and we love to keep things organized. So I set it up this way. Like I said, if you wanna rearrange it, you can. You'll see that I move it around. And again, with these being magnetic, you don't even have to take each pan out. You can just pop it off and move it around and connect it back together. From miles away, I can tell that something's off. The way you look and how you pause when you talk. I think you said enough. You said you love for me something brand new. You said this is something you would never do. Here we are in your car. Let me see who you are. Now I've cooked chicken, eggs, different meats, pastas in these pans and they cook beautifully. You are going to want to cook, I think they recommend that you cook on like a low medium heat. That's just going to help your pans sustain the longevity of the life of your pans. So I'm cooking on a low medium and I made the perfect scrambled eggs. I did not add any type of spray, butter, anything. I wanted to show you just exactly how non-stick these pans are. They did not stick. Like even once I was done cooking, everything scraped off nicely like you know how sometimes when you cook something and they stick a little bit and you kind of have to scrub it off that was not the case with these pans i was literally like shook with how good my eggs turned out with these we love scrambled eggs we love eggs period in this house and if you were like me you know it is very easy to ruin your eggs and not have the perfect eggs these pans props Props, truly non-stick. I want to give a big thank you to Caraway for collaborating with me and sponsoring today's video. 
I will have a link down below you guys that will take you to the Caraway site and you will get a discount code if you are interested in trying out these pots and pans. My kitchen was honestly not disastrous, but this is just like an everyday spleed clean. So this is after cooking, after just like a busy day. My kitchen just needed to be clean. It's mostly the counters, my dishes. I had a sink full of dishes that needed to get done. I needed to unload the dishwasher, sweep and mop the floors. So we are going to do all of that. If you guys are needing some quick speed motivation, this video is the video for you today. Every moment tonight, they lend me to you Every single time you look at me I lose it too Why don't you come sit next to me Let things happen naturally Like it used to be Check out this cute little grass that Lakin is growing. He brought this home from school. So I decided I would display it in the kitchen. I'm gonna add some water to it because I don't think it's had any since he made it. And I decided to set it on this little tier tray. I did take out some of my spring decor that was on there. I've been slowly taking it down and setting up more neutral stuff. Now I'm gonna tackle these dishes. I had a nice sink full. This was like two days of dishes. So it was definitely time I came in and I had like that dirty dishes smell in my kitchen. I'm like, yeah, we're, we're getting this kitchen clean. Ever since you guys recommended that finish, I think this is, yeah, that's finished. Um, the rinse aid, it has definitely made a tremendous difference in my dishes. So they are coming out nice and clean, crystal clear. Thank you guys for the tips on that. I've been using the Cascade and the finish rinse aid and it has worked amazing. So much better, balconies and bathtubs, what you want, why don't we just get Now with my pots and pans, like I stated earlier in the video, they do recommend you hand wash your pots and pans. So I have not ran these through the dishwasher. That care little booklet is going to tell you exactly how to maintain and properly wash your dishes. I have been just using good soap and water. Since they are nonstick, these wash so easily. Like everything comes off with no problem. I'm not having to put my back into scrubbing, burnt on food off of it nothing like that I just use that scrub daddy it has not scraped the pan there's no chips in it or anything like that it's not too abrasive and my pans are coming out nice and clean you will see I've cooked with these like I said several times now I don't have any burnt on marks there's no stains on my pans everything has been washing off pretty good and I'm impressed so far I've been just following those care instructions and so far my pans are still looking brand new. Right now I'm 
My air fryer is also something that I hand wash. I'm not sure if you can even put it in the dishwasher or not. I think you can. I don't know. I just choose to hand wash it. I usually wash it out every time I use it depending on what it is. That way there's no um, grease or anything built up cooking into other food. So I always give this a nice scrub down with my scrub daddy. You guys know I love my scrub daddy. This thing is awesome. It does not scratch your dishes and it gets everything off. Tell me what you want to do. Baby, let me love you, let me love you, let me love you, let me love you. Baby, let me love you, let me love you, let me love, let me love. Baby, let me love you. Just say the word and we can leave this place. I think this was the last spring thing that I had in my kitchen was that canister utensil holder. So I wanted to swap that out. I just used the Be Grateful one. I actually want to get a different utensil holder. I'm kind of just over the ones that I've had. I've had these for like a couple years now and I just want something different. I know at one point Ray Dunn was like the thing. It was the rave. I had got into it a little bit. I wasn't one of those that like bought it to like display it. I bought it to use it. Like you see every piece of radon I have in my house, I'm using it for something. I'm slowly kind of like losing my taste for it. I've noticed like a lot of people have. There's like so much radon in the stores now. About two years ago, you had to like fight to get something. But I think I'm going to change it up real soon just because it's kind of like anything else in life. It's you outgrow it i guess you can say so my um style my taste is starting to change a little bit i do still love it i probably always will have a little piece of redone in my heart but i'm definitely thinking of switching it up and going with something a little bit more different um i'm really loving the blacks a good black solid color has just like been calling my name especially in the kitchen I have not used my Fabuloso in so long, you guys. This made my kitchen smell so good. You guys know I've been using the Pine Sol and wiping my counters and disinfecting it with that. But today I was like, you know what? I'm going to use some of my blue Fabuloso. This used to just be my like holy grail of cleaning. And I have not used it in a long time. Like the bottle is still full. Before that bottle would not last me barely a couple weeks. I actually plan to do a deep clean real soon. I want to just get up and scrub off my cabinets down do some other deep cleaning in my house especially the bathrooms you know we had been getting some sicknesses and I think we're finally like clear of it Lakin had a sore throat I had a sore throat for a while Samir had a bad cough runny nose Tank had a runny nose so I really feel like my house is in for a good deep clean so stay tuned for that I will be scrubbing down my kitchen my bathrooms and most of the other main areas that we've kind of been like cooped up in I snagged up this vase from the Goodwill for like 99 cents. I have a lilac bush in my backyard, you guys, and I am thrilled. Lilacs are my favorite flowers and they smell so good. So I clipped some off of the lilac tree. I'm just going to fill up some vase with the water and I'm going to display them in my kitchen. I felt like this just 
gave my clean kitchen that nice pop. My kitchen smelled so, so good, you guys. The flowers, and now I kind of feel like I just want to always have flush fresh flowers I was reading this thing how they said like the fresh flowers kind of like stimulate your mood boost it it just makes you feel good it smells good and I will say adding these fresh lilacs in my kitchen definitely just like brought the cleanliness of my kitchen together at the end